hello guys welcome to another video here we are be trying to solve a challenge here on the defend the web playground and it's the challenge called where am i uh, this challenge is part of the challenge given to us uh, when in the current um, cfss internship that i'm participating in it's a penetration testing internship and we're given uh, this particular uh, challenge to solve it's more or less uh, asking us to log in a password here and uh, if we try to type in any password if you hit login it's going to tell you invalid login details so this is a web exploitation that has a lot to do with a file part uh, file part uh, manipulations so i call it more like the local file part uh, vulnerability so we're going to see if we can manipulate because i'm seeing something like where am i and it says get out of here so we're going to intercept this to see if we can see a way to manipulate that in order to do that we just need to turn on bob uh turn on my intercept here <coughs> and then turn on uh foxy proxy once you set it to bob uh, i'm just going to go ahead here and just type in any random password and hit login Okay, once I hit login, it should take me right to the page. This is just a web socket. Forward, forward, forward. Those are not it. So, yeah, basically, uh, this is it here. Uh, this is the playground where I'm I. And what do we notice here? We notice a, an, a parameter here, which comes in right after the query string. So before we start in this, I'm just going to control R or just send this to repeater. Over here on the repeater page, all I need to do here is to try to see if I can manipulate this particular um, uh, local file path that was included right after this query string. Okay. Um, usually, uh, what I would do is to click send. Once you click send, we've got a response with a HTML page right now. It's just uh, just a normal response and now let's manipulate this by either deleting everything or you can just type in login uh, something of that nature anything you just hit send and let's see what happens and as you can see it came up with the result which is the password right here okay so as you can see we have a password and that should be the password that we need to log in with and that was just by manipulating the local file part here okay that's the vulnerability we see in this web exploitation so basically you can even clear everything that came after that query string and hit send and you would still get the same answer so i'm just going to copy in that password right here uh, more like country c see. once you copy that uh, just come back here turn off my proxy come back here and turn off bob Okay, once I turn off Bob, I will just paste this here and hit login. Okay, once I click on login, voila, we got congratulations. So we have passed this particular uh, challenge. So basically, this challenge is about you know web exploitation based off local file parts and more like a vulnerability with it. So we just manipulated the local file part here that was included on the URL here on the client side right after the query string and we're able to solve this okay thank you for studying with me thank you for learning with me i'll see you guys in my next video and i do enjoy the rest of your day ciao